Wait, what are we doing today, girls? We're picking beets and canning beets. Picking and canning beets? So we want to go about one inch up because you don't want it to bleed when Mama cooks them. So right in there, cut cut the top off. Open them scissors and cut, baby. Good job. Good. We're getting some nice size on them. So in the meantime, what you got going in the oven there? So I prepped all my jars and lids, washed them all, and now they're in here staying nice and warm and sterile. All right, they're done. We're ready to pull the lid off. Look at those beauties. All right, so what are we doing now? We have cooked the beets and we put them in a cold bath and this makes it easier to actually peel them. It's starting to smell good in here. All that cinnamon and spices and sugar and vinegar and I'm fogging the camera. All right, so they're all ready. They've been cooked and dunked in the water bath and peeled, courtesy of Shelly Kincaid. That's right. And now we're chopping them. Alright guys, so I got a jar right here and obviously we busted into these guys because they are just absolutely fantastic and these beets never last long in this family. They are so good, you've got to try this recipe. So I got a fork with me, let's give it a try. I don't have to hide from my wife this time because we've canned so many beets. She's like, please, eat them Mike, eat them. But check this out, look at this, I'll show them to you. Doesn't that look good, all that red color? Here, let me get one of these out of here. Love these things. All right, check that out. Look at those guys. They are so darn good. They're like sweet and tangy and all of it. And the thing about these beets, man, the kids love them too. I mean, how do you get your kids to eat vegetables? This is how. The other thing that we like to do with these if you guys haven't done it before, I know a lot of people have heard about this. A lot of people haven't heard about this, but the juice in here is so good. And if you guys like hard boiling eggs, 
take your eggs, hard boil them, peel the shell off of them, and then just throw them right in the jar once you get done with the beets and let them sit in there for a day or so and they'll soak up that flavor and those hard boiled eggs with that beet juice soaked into them is awesome guys. So anyway, I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit the like button man. Subscribe if you want to follow along. I'm going to have another beet here. Have an awesome week. I'll see you guys in the next video. Adios.